good day children again i am here with uh, exam corner question number 7 from history the question is in the areas conquered the restriction of the local population to french rule were mixed why why the reactions of the local population wherever uh, napoleon bonaparte and his uh, army conquered their response was very mixed one why was it so initially in many places such as holland and switzerland as well as in certain cities like brussels mainz milan and warsaw the french armies were welcomed as harbingers of liberty it means in the beginning french army was welcomed like harbingers the places already you came to know they were welcomed as harbingers means the liberators from the clutches of old restricted societies but the things did not remain here itself the initial enthusiasm soon turned to hostility as it became clear that the new administrative arrangements did not go hand in hand with political freedom that's true the administrative reforms or administrative arrangements whatever are there they were good but people did not understand or people do not understand whatever the reforms are there they wanted political freedom only then the other arrangements can be seen by them administrative reforms were very fine reforms but uh, they were unseen when you are not given a right then the people turned hostile and then again uh, whatever the earlier was there the bourbon family kings uh, used to increase the taxes here also their ruler napoleon bonaparte increased the taxes earlier bourbon kings also uh, restricted censorship here also napoleon restricted censorship and forced one more thing forced conscription was there into the french armies which required to conquer the rest of the europe all seemed to overweigh the advantages of the administrative changes what is this uh, forced conscription which was termed as very harsh as uh, napoleon went on invading other parts of europe the number of soldiers uh, went on decreasing decline so wherever he is uh, available from that region he forced the people to join the army that is called as forced recruitment forcefully armies were filled with the soldiers who are not actually trained who actually do not want to join the army they all were forced to enter the army so these things seem to overweigh the advantages of administrative changes and this is the answer this is the question for three marks and you can enjoy with this kind of answer you can present in your own words okay thank you very much